Damn it. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know your brother. your fault you're gonna be this annoying for the next two hours get used to it what the hell man what you know cut it out Jesus you guys you gonna make me yeah hey Vince Justin's gonna make me it's too hot for this shit Vince I'm making him hot now yeah Danny you're making me hot Oh, shit! Come on, Vince. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The window... Hey, falls. Justin. That shit ain't See that right, guy man. in the beat-up truck? Shit ain't right. I bet he Shut lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey. How many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? I mean, it ain't like that. You were convicted, Danny. You gotta admit that much. Oh, come on, Vince. That don't mean I did it. My lawyer's gonna be hearing tell about you what, this. Guys, He's gonna I have your afraid motherfucking to say it. jobs when he I'm hears really about this. I'm really missing my girlfriend right now. I'm, I'm guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse swear, than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. Haven't heard her voice in months. Really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know, I love her, man. Forget about her. Not worth holding on to that guilt. Wish I could, brother. Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from white collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? Hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, how about some water back here? Shut I up thought you took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit man, and tell them you didn't know what you were up, doing? Or I'll set you I up. I lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand. See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. It's a tough call. Why do more time than you need to? Gotta stay clean, man. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh... A pyramid scheme. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. Fuck Wall Street. 
How much did you make off with anyway? Enough. So like... Couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy! Ho oh, ho! When we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. Two kids! You touch a couple kids, Vince? I'm innocent. Give me a fucking break, man. Like you can talk? Yeah, but Vince is full of shit. I know he did something. That's just weak. So what was it, man? Must have been something real stupid, huh? Yeah, I did something. Well, that's specific. What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? Fuck you! Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, shit! Oh, man. What the hell is going on back Red there? Tree, knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Sit down, goddammit! Right. Hey, Vince! Hey, let him go, man! Damn it, Crow Tree! Those Don't make me come back there! He's gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not oh, want to get up, in the middle bro. of that shit, Danny. Motherfucker! I knew you didn't have any balls. I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's your empathy, man? What? Help him, Danny! What's that? Speak up, boy! Fucking hear. chain's too short! Crabtree, I'm warning you one last Stop listening, time, goddammit! You gotta get, get in get there! Get yourself in there! Wake that shit up, Come on, man. man! Come on, boy! Get back there! Okay, asshole. Let him go! Get in between them, goddammit! He's gonna kill that boy! Crabtree? Last what warning! I say Do let something. him go, goddammit! What the fuck was that? Oh. Jesus, what happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy! Answer me back that there! That guy's still alive! Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He, he made a move on me! I, I, I don't know! He's still breathing? He's, uh... Fucking fuck! You gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in! Oh, don't call it in yet! Just, just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute! He might still be alive. Call a damn ambulance, man! I just need a minute! I need a minute to think! You ain't got a minute! Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth! Okay, okay, calm down. Take it easy. Everybody needs to calm the fuck down! Situation's bad enough as it is. He's right. Let's all just take it down a notch, okay? You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. What the fuck? Get us the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. Hey, drive. I said Let's go, we're man. staying right here. We're safe inside the bus. Nothing's gonna Holy shit! Jesus. Oh my god. Hey. Hey! You need to call someone. You hear me? We need to. Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. What the hell, man? Back up, back up. Fuck! 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 Can't reach us. Are you sure about that? That ankle's gonna get. Shit! You gonna help out here, Vince? Come on! We gotta do something! Find a weapon. What kind of weapon do you think you're gonna find back here, asshole? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun! Good thinking, Justin! Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath. Oh, fuck me. Get the gun!
gun, man! Pick it up, Vince! Hurry up! Shoot this asshole, Vince! Do it! Oh! Watch it, man! Sorry. Sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. God damn it. Shit. Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. Where are the damn keys, man? They weren't on him. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, don't. buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot in you, man. You gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince! Fire the fucking gun! I think you just pissed them off. Yeah. Yeah, save the shells. No way! Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's foot? Well, what do you think's gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun! We gotta do this! Back off! Vince! What the fuck? I'm sorry, man. Fuck you! Do it! Hurry! Justin's just gonna slow you down. Do it again! Come on, let's go! Michelle, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this? What do you think that does to a kid? I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I want her to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Beck is a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Pekka, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? 
That sounds like a great idea. Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Actually, I wanted to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. How we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, her sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. I just don't want to see her get hurt, Shell. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Again. Whoa! What's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. It's... It's just the watchdogs. I guess they found a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know? It was... It was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... After a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca... Something's going on outside. What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on. We gotta find Roman. 
Let's mop them. If so, care we were. Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No. They didn't get that close. Who is he? I got no idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck this is in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. And send him on his what way. What if there are more of them? <sighs> he could have been scouting. Uh, that's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't just let him go. It's too dangerous. Who knows if he has friends waiting to attack? Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. That is strange. That doesn't mean anything. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. We stole their boat from that teenage kid at gunpoint. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Fuck you, Roman. Shell, come on. Roman's right. We need to protect ourselves first. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Fine. I guess this is what we have to do. There's gotta be another way. Tell me. What if he comes back? With weapons, or, or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? Jesus. There really is no other choice, is there? We can't keep him here, and we can't let him go. Let's mop them. If there's even it's a so chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us, we can't so risk it. I won't ask you to watch, but if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. You have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Go fish. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time. Roman isn't taking any chances. And I should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. You're going to get us both in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break-in just last month. Ugh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. Open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. 
Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? Probably nothing. Don't worry about it. He said it was important. Yeah, well, these days everything's important to Roman. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. Roman? Good, you're here. What's this all about? It's Stephanie. What happened? I caught her trying to escape. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? Yeah. You said that next time it'd have to be one of us. You went along with it last time. You weren't convinced it was the right thing to do. Now I need to know that you're with us, 100%. Let's talk to her first, see if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. If we give her a second chance, she might not try to leave so quietly. Got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to- Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. That does. Shell, it's time.
okay? What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down, get safe. Shell, hey! Shell, be safe for me, Thomas. Shelly, load! What the fuck? No. God damn it! Got like 60 miles left, I think. Ain't shit. Ugh, 63 miles to go. Ah, oh, I miss the days of taking shortcuts. Hey, you getting up? Good. Should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. Ropes, man. I see you hiding down there with your boyfriend. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't... What's your name? Roughly. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? It's mine. I didn't steal it. Alright, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on. Scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Okay. Yeah. I'd like a ride. That'd be good. Thanks. Hell yeah! Get in! Let's tear it up! I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she likes to party? Just get in. We'll get there. Or somewhere. Eventually. Name's Nate, by the way. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go.
Good shit, ain't it? Hell of a kick, but it takes the edge off. You'll get used to it. Actually, I think that's it for me. I'm good. Alright, fine. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? You must have been with a crew. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. Sure, yeah. I mean, I'll tell you about who I was with. Don't leave out any juicy deets, all right? Huh. Uh, okay. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They are all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. If we found survivors, it was the same every time. He... he... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang! They'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rat? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. Sure, whatever. Sure, whatever? Come on. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck, man? Kill one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was wrong, right? Damn. Here, get a look. Fuck! Ah, ah, like a nine, right? Maybe you got know high standards. If you say so, I'm gonna flip. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. I... Oh shit! Go! Get out! <laughs> Boss! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! Okay, get ready! Don't stop running! And keep your head down! Good hustle. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. Alright, what are we gonna do? First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. Down! See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. Alright, yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Just keep pushing!
Shit! Push! Uh, uh, End of the road. What now? We're gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously, this time. No fucking around. Yeah, no problem. Easy as pie. Just don't get shot. If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you want to go first, that's fine. window and keep that fucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Then throw me the gun and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Cover my ass now. Remember, don't stop shooting. Fire! Ah! Come on! <laughs> Remember, don't stop shooting. should be good. Go! Thanks. We're not done yet. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this ass. Follow me. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? We should put it out of its misery. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it.
think I saw a guy. Oh shit. here you monsters whoa gramps i told you not to come back here think you can just leave your mask at home and now you're with this fucking spook first off watch the fucking racism this is my boy secondly i don't fucking know you we were just passing by like anyone else Bullshit! you came back to finish us off and take all our food you've lost your goddamn marbles she's dying and now she can see your face shut this guy up I can't handle this. Greed, look at how much progress we've made. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I see. Fuck you, Nate. I saved your ass. You didn't do shit. Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on! Can we still be friends? No. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign? Well... I'm thinking... Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Neither? That's not really an answer. You don't set the rules around here. Well, that's a fact. Okay. How about... Well, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, uh... You gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. What I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Thanks, jerk. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Oh, to remind me how hideous I was. Nah. Make sure you keep on keeping on. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it.
He ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but well, you've come a long way, Bonnie, and I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. I know. Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? Bonnie.